Hi everybody, thanks for checking out my infrared sauna vlog. So this is where I sit in my infrared sauna and I have a light therapy and um, I meditate and I talk about spiritual topics that I need for my own self-evaluation and to stay on target. And so I hope people listen and get some insight and some spiritual guidance by uh, listening to this vlog. So yesterday I started a three-part series on um, dealing with uh, adversity and when things really go off the rails and, you know, like life takes a real big bump, which is what happened to me because I broke my wrist and had 13 screws put in it two weeks ago. And so the first, <clears throat> excuse me, the first part of my vlog yesterday was about listening to your intuition because you're going to really avert a lot of problems if you really just tap into that intuition. You know, I mean, for real. And then the second part of the vlog, which I want to talk about today, is when you're faced with serious adversity, like things that are going to at least temporarily up, uproot your life or affect your life in a very dramatic way, you have to pay attention and say, what does the universe want me to pay attention to, right? Because... Clearly, I wasn't listening to my intuition, and clearly, the universe has been trying to get me to listen, and I haven't been listening, and sometimes when we don't listen, the universe will just give us a little smack. It won't put us down for good, but it will get our attention. It's like, oh yeah, okay, hello, you were, you were trying to reach me? Duh. Okay, so obviously, I needed to pay more attention. Right, not just to my intuition and trying to be aware that I needed to get my wrist guards together, but things in my life, you know, because I had allowed up until this point, literally this is the turning point, boom. Up until this point I had allowed my allowed myself to go back to unhealthy patterns, unhealthy relationship many unhealthy things and I deluded myself into thinking that things had changed or that I could handle it or that it was actually fine in some crazy way when it wasn't and so sometimes when we're faced with like really pretty intense adversity and drama if we don't pay attention the universe will make sure that we pay attention because you like literally get stopped in your tracks and you know it's not meant to hurt you or it's not meant to cause you any pain or suffering but it's meant to get you to literally wake up and smell the coffee and pay attention to all the signs and all your guides and all your angels and what they're trying to tell you to keep you on your path because it's really easy to get off the path you know it really is easy right so that is, I think, a really prominent lesson when you're faced with some really challenging adversities in your life and um, take the time to really meditate on it and ponder it and try to get to the bottom of what the message is, you know. And for me, it was clear that I was just off my path and heading down a road to basically hell because... In the end, if I'd stayed on that road and these toxic relationships and whatever, I would have been depleted and probably ended up just losing at least a lot of my soul. <laughs> anyway, so thank you for tuning in. I hope you please subscribe. I'm happy to be back. And...